back to the second part of our story time and craft. You, if you haven't seen our first video after this video, please uh, be sure to uh, watch our first part where Miss Linda read Alex the Fairy. Hola amigos, gracias por estar aquí de nuevo. Si no vieron el primer video, después de este video, uh, váyanse a nuestra página de Facebook y ahí van a encontrar la primera parte de esta actividad y estuvimos leyendo con Miss Linda, Alice the Fairy. So, we were really inspired by Alice and I really wanted to make a cute wand. And you guys can see her wand here. We're going to try to recreate it. Entonces, nosotros queríamos hacer una varita mágica como la de Alice y hoy les vamos a enseñar cómo la pueden hacer en casa. So, let me read you guys the materials. These are really simple materials that you guys can just find at home. We have a paper towel tube. If you don't have that, you can use a straw. And we have some ribbons. We, you can use some egg cartons. And you'll just need some scissors and markers. And if you have a stapler at home. But if you are missing some of these things I have here with me, you guys can recreate it with anything you guys have at home. Entonces, les voy a decir muy rápido todas las cosas que vamos a necesitar para hacer nuestra varita mágica. Vamos a usar un tubo de las toallas de papel. Si no, si no tienen uno de esos, también pueden usar un tubo del papel del baño. Si no tienen esto, pueden usar un popote. También van a necesitar unos listones si quieren usarlos. Nosotros usamos el cartón de huevos y van a necesitar lápices lápices de color, tijeras, y una engrapadora. So, I'm ready to start. So, what you'll need is to grab your uh, paper towel tube and you'll fold it in half and you guys can color it or you can wrap around a piece of paper, construction paper. And then after that, after you color it or you use some paper to wrap it, you are going to attach your ribbon. Entonces, el primer paso es van a usar el tubito, lo van a doblar así, la mitad, lo pueden pintar, colorear, o si quieren ponerle un papel, una cartulina así como yo la hice, usa un papel morado. I just wrapped some construction paper around, but you guys can always color if you want. And then, le vas a poner el listón, le vas a poner, le vas a grapar el listón aquí, you are going to staple your ribbon, whatever you want to use. I'll show you real quick. Just staple it to the top. Le ponen una grapa aquí arribita. And then you have a nice little frill here. So lastly, you are going to cut whatever shape you want. I didn't know how to draw a star, but if you guys know how to do that, you guys can surely do that at home. You're just gonna use the top part of your egg carton and you're going to trace whatever shape you want to do. I did a flower and then I cut two. Entonces, van a hacer la forma de su varita. Um, nosotros usamos lo de arriba, lo del uh, el cartón de huevos y luego recortamos. Yo hice una flor porque no pude trazar un, una estrella, pero pueden hacer cualquier cosa que quieran hacer ustedes en casa. And then, once I traced it, I colored it in. Cuando lo recorté, lo pinté con unos marcadores. And now, you just gotta attach it to your wand. Y ahora nomás, se lo ponen arriba de su varita. So, you'll trace two. You'll have two shapes here. And you just staple them. You probably need some parents help because it's kind of hard to do it.
want to do at home. Entonces ustedes pueden poner cualquier cosa, pero así lo hicimos hoy, aquí es donde nosotros. Y si usted lo, ustedes lo hacen en casa, por favor de mandarnos una foto aquí en los comentarios en Facebook porque nos encanta mirar sus creaciones. We love seeing your recreations of our, of our crafts. So if you guys recreate this wand and you guys do it at home, please take a picture and share it to our Facebook. Put it on our comments. We love seeing you guys' uh, recreations. So that is all we have for today. Thank you for joining us. Uh, once again, we have our new pro two programs, new programs starting this uh, Friday and Saturday. We have Quarantine Tales uh, every Saturday at 1 p.m. And we'll have featured museums with Miss Camille tomorrow. So if you want to check on that, just check our Facebook. All the information is there. Muchas gracias por estar con nosotros. Nos vemos la próxima semana. We'll see you next week.